You? Is anybody? There's Molly, folks. That means your friends, the Goldbergs, are here. Brought to you by Does, the new kind of soap for everything in your wash. First, let's drop in on the Dozen family. Well, there's Daisy's young friend Donald sitting in the Dozen parlor waiting for Daisy. He's having a heart-to-heart -heart talk with Ma Dozen. You know, Mrs. Dozen, Daisy's different from other girls. Is that so? Well, sure, she's so smart. Well, she knows about housekeeping and washing, and even does. Well, land sakes, Donald, Daisy ought to know about does. She's heard me say hundreds of times what a new kind of soap it is. And she's seen how does does everything in our wash, from Pa's overalls and my towels to her rayon slips. Gee, I'd sure like Daisy to wash my overalls someday. Well, Donald, when it comes to washing overalls, no soap can beat does. Pa gets his greasy black, but does does him easy. Why, I don't do any hard scrubbing or even fuss with a bar soap anymore, because does gets rid of dirt all by itself. You know, you sound like Daisy when you talk about <laughs> does. Well, there's just one way a body can sound about does, and that's enthusiastic. Why, I've never seen whiter towels than does does. It gets them dazzling white. White as white any soap can turn out. Gee, Mrs. Dozum, Daisy looked pretty today in that new blue dress. Why, that's not new, Donald. I've dozed it heaps of times. You know, that's where does is different. It's safer for those nice colors of wash. Yet you can't beat does for getting out tough dirt. Does does everything. Gee, did you ever stop to think Daisy and does are sure a lot alike? Nothing can beat Daisy either. She's got everything. Well, Donald, that's real devotion. And you know, ladies, you'll be just as devoted to Does. Why, it's the only leading granulated wash day soap that gives longer life to colors, plus unsurpassed whiteness and real cleaning power for tough dirt. Change to Does. D-U-Z. It does everything in your wash. And now the Goldbergs. Molly is an out-and-out -out reformer and a believer in the ultimate goodness of human beings. And though she has wondered a good deal lately if her experiments in salvation were going to work out, it looks now as if her faith will be rewarded. While she was facing her neighbors, trying to justify her trust in George and Grace, who had run off with the town funds, two phone calls came for her. The first from George, the second from Grace. Though neither one knew of the other's message, both announced they were returning to Lastonbury. And now, tonight, without telling her family... Molly has left the back door open for George to get in. Listen. Jay? Jay? Huh? You, you sleeping? Yes. Sleep. Yeah. Jay? But what time is it? Molly, please. Excuse me. Did you lock all the doors? Mm-hmm. The front door and the back door. He's knocking. Yeah, who? David. David, come in, David. David? You, you're not sleeping, David. I, I was sleeping, so, so I woke up. And then I was thirsty, so I, I went down for milk. And then the back door was open. You see that, Molly? I'll close it. Uh, please. I asked you, did you close the doors? Well, can, can't I go? Uh, I'm going. Your slippers, don't go without your slippers. Sure, don't, don't go with your feet. Jake, Jake let me better go. I'm going. Uh, what, what's the matter, Molly? David. David, dear friend. Yes? D David, dear. David, when Jake comes up, you go down. Down? Down where? Downstairs. And, and, and David. Yeah? Don't ask me why or what. I'll tell you later. Why? B because, David. Why? Just open the back door. Why, Molly? Molly, why? David. Molly, why? George. Huh? Yes. What? He's coming and she's coming. George and Grace together? No. George don't know Grace is coming and Grace don't know George is coming and that's and the reason. What's the reason? David, darling, just open the door so it'll be open for George. He's coming tonight? 
Yeah. Uh, how did you know? Didn't you hide the telephone? Uh, I thought you said the, the operator. I didn't say Jake said. So? So George called, and he said to me on the telephone that he's 30 miles from my locality, Lastonbury, and he'll be here. And, and, and Jake don't know? David, David, for complicated plural reasons, I don't want Jake to know. Um, what's the plural, huh? More than one. What, Molly? David. Molly. Molly, enough is not enough. You, you didn't have sufficient, huh? But, David, if George called and said he was coming, I, 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 I shouldn't leave the back door open for him. I, I shouldn't do it. But, but if Jake will... Jake, darling, Jake, David, day lately. You, you see how Jake has got rings on his eyes. I, I want him to go to check himself anywhere because you know Jake's pressure, David. Yes. Why, why, when he took her ready by carbonate tonight. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and I have to spare Jake. I don't have to spare Jake, David. Yeah, you, yourself too, you, you have to spare. Look, look, look what you look like, look. I, well, I, I'll, I'll look better, David. But with me, it's not internal, darling, my looking. My looking is not internal. It's all X. My hair I have to wash, and, and I'll fix my dress a little bit, and I'll put a new model with me, David. It's all X. All right, all right, it's all X. But why is George coming back, Molly? Well, well, what's your idea? David, my idea is George is coming back because he because? thinks... And, and, and why is Grace coming back? Only because she thinks George is here. And David, darling, now we're both together here, maybe I can... Of course the door was wide open, wide open. Who left a light in the window? A light? A light in the window? D David, go see. Uh, yes. Night. 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 You had your milk already, David? Uh, yeah. Have more. Yeah. Good night, David. Good night. <sighs> you, you comfy, Jake, dear? Yeah, thank you. Darling, did you notice the time, Jake? It's time for everybody was sleeping. That's the time. Thank you. You're welcome. Good night. Good night. Great sweetheart, dear. Darling, dear, I want you to go and check yourself. Jake, darling, don't get worried. Only I want you to go and check yourself for your pressure, darling. And lately, Jake, darling, you got rings, circles, Jake, dear, darling. And you'll go to the tailor, sweetheart, and you'll let him take in a little bit, an inch in the waist. I noticed, Jake, dear. Be calm and relax yourself, darling. Who have I got? Only you? Wait, sweetheart, I'll fix your pillow. It's all right. Sleep, dear. Good night. Good night. The midnight freight. Good night. Good night. You comfy, my darling? Yeah. Be comfy. Now what? Who? Come in. Excuse me, I did. What? You uh, closed the milk bottle? Uh, yeah. David, it's after midnight. Expire, please. I will. Good night. Night. Good night. Molly, yeah. if you don't mind, I'd like a crumb of that blanket. Sure, darling. Why a crumb? Why a crumb? Here, here darling. Thank you. Night. Night. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah. That's uh, the barn door, evidently. Oh, yeah. Thunder. Good night. Raining. Good night. What's this tonight? Yes? It's me, Mom. Rosalie? Rosalie's not sleeping. What is it? I just closed it. Good night. Well, it was open and I closed it. 
Good night. Good night. Good night, Ma. Good night. Who left the light on in the back room? Good night. I just put out the light. Good night. Night. I have to see to that luck in the morning. Yeah. Night. I put the light out. Who put it on? Evidently. Evidently what? Evidently. I think I'll go and see. See what? I if it's closed. If Rosie closed it? Maybe it's stay. not. Stay. I'll go. Jake, if I want... Stay. Oh. What's that? Spody. Why is he barking? I'll, I'll see. Stay. Jake, I'll see. Stay. Please, go away from the window, Jake. You got broncos. And you haven't got broncos. I got tantos. You! Who's there? You! Are you? Who? Jake, away from the window. Molly, who? Yes? Molly. Yeah? Somebody closed the door. Shall I open it? Open it for what? Uh, for Spordy. Spordy? Mm, would I even leave a dog out in such a night, Jake? Well, in spite of the comedy of doors that are closed but insist on staying open, Molly hasn't lost sight of that factor that George, alone, deserted, confused, unhappy, has returned to Lastenbury and that he is not lost as a human being because he has the courage to face the consequences of his own mistakes. Say, a lady from Texas writes she'd like to meet the whole Goldberg family. She says, I'd like to meet the Dozen family, too, especially Unky. He's a dear. Well, she should have seen Unky yesterday when he told Say, me. Say, Clayton, you said does washes everything. Well, I meant... So that's... I tried washing my new parrot with does. Your parrot? Yeah, and the darn parrot almost bit my finger off. Well... Say, are you sure does does wash everything? Unky does does wash everything that's washable. I didn't say anything about parrots. Oh. I did say this new kind of soap does work shirts, towels to pretty rayon slips. Why, compared to other leading granulated wash day soaps, does gives longer life to the nice colors you wash, plus unsurpassed whiteness for towels and real cleaning power for the grimiest work clothes. So you see, ladies, does really does everything in your wash. And friends, does sends you this wartime reminder. All soaps contain vital war material, so don't waste does. Measure it carefully into your machine. See to it every bit of does you use does more. Be sure to listen to the next episode of The Goldbergs, written for you by Gertrude Berg. This is Clayton Collier speaking and reminding you to do as the dozens do. Let does, the new kind of soap, do everything in your wash.